Welcome back to Ozarks Fox AM. Kaylee is feeling her green thumb, and she's also showing us how to make this adorable green planter. Kaylee? It's a little green. I'm telling you, that plant looks pretty healthy It's to not me. black, that's for it's sure. It's not Just black. Just a tinge. <laughs> so this is something easy you can make at home. Well, somewhat easy. It can get very, very messy. <laughs> yeah. So uh, you probably have the supplies that you already need. You probably already have all of it at home. So that's what makes it easy. Otherwise, it's messy and it might take a while. Here's how to make it. <laughs>
A couple of things to mention here, or at least make everyone aware of. This was a plastic container from the dollar store, which I originally thought would melt from the heat of the blow dryer, mm -hmm. but it didn't. Uh, and I felt like I was pretty close to it, so it mainly melted the crayons. I didn't notice any signs of melting the actual plastic, so Dollar General came through. <laughs> and uh, Did you have a backup plan, Kaylee? I did. I, I had a glass of a pretty big candle that was empty. I cleaned all that out. Mm -hmm. So I was going to use glass if the plastic didn't work. Another thing, you may not want to keep this in high higher heat. Mm -hmm. I'd say anything above 80 might be questionable. But I'm going to keep this inside, so I'm not too worried about it. But if you are worried about the crayons remelting and you losing all of your hard work, maybe put a coat of clear spray paint over it, and that might do the trick. That might keep it all sealed in. Okay, I love it. And the possibilities are endless. Like, you did green for Earth Day, but you could red, pink, every color oh, yeah, in the crayon absolutely. box. Absolutely. Right, it looks like Mother Earth. That was it's totally um, what I was going for. <laughs> See? <laughs> love it. That's fantastic. You knew what you are doing the whole time, Kayla. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That looks great. Oh, now, and Kelly, thanks for the mint. Here's your jar back. Oh, that's my jar. Thank <laughs> you so much. I appreciate it. You're so good. Now, Kaylee, once that gets bigger, you're going to have to transplant that because yeah. that mint takes over. It does. You're going to have a, a kitchen full of mint. You got a place outside for some mint? Yeah, I can probably section something off. All right. All right. There you go. <laughs> Don't go here because coming up, we have another musical performance from the Hay Goods during their quarantine sessions. Ooh. Don't want to miss that. We'll be right back.